Well, hello there, everyone. Here to talk about right here, talk about for meeting the company and uh, talk about for agreements. And I don't know if anybody that uh, wonders as to where that, that, you know, can we really agree on everything when it comes to uh, working out, talking about stuff and maybe about that, you know, it's like taking care of a, an important matter, you know, anything like that, you know, the things that you like and what you don't like, you know, etc. But, uh, uh, you know, here lately I've been thinking about is to where that one of these days if I do uh, wind up uh, getting hired on to a job at some point and uh, somebody's going to maybe ask me, yeah, they're trying to ask you um, if you want to go out to dinner with them sometime, you know, yeah, have lunch with them sometime and uh, they're going to maybe ask you this, uh, this person uh, in particular is going to ask you, uh, do you like ice cream or do you like salads uh, or you know, do you like uh, sushi or something like that? And uh, so yeah, that, that they're trying to get some ideas about uh, what you like and what you don't like. And uh, but let's just say if it's uh, if we're talking about that, uh, maybe during the meeting it could be something um, that uh, that is related to uh, what you uh, you know what maybe three people can agree on and what uh, was disagreed on. So yeah, that uh, you can't really. Uh, make everybody happy and you can't really uh, agree on everything that is talked about so changes that's going on that uh, maybe not very many people are happy about or it could be uh, something else but uh, you know that's something else if anybody say for better or for the worse that uh, you know exactly but uh, what else could it be that could be what you call for better or for the worst and uh, for what's agreed on but uh, but this right here, yeah, I put this together right here whenever I was doing this Photoshop work right here. Yeah, it's kind of looking like um, maybe just a little bit uh, like an avatar. I'm like, yeah, that, uh, exactly about who that, that lady is right next to you. But uh, but I, you know, if anybody that, you know, I could probably say that, uh, that yeah, that, uh, you know, anything that you're going to be doing maybe on Facebook or maybe, uh, you know, another chat line if you're going to have like on your mobile phone, if you're going to have a... Uh, uh, like, uh, you know, me, you know, mix or I'm like, yeah, if you're going to have a, you know, match, I guess the name of the, of the web uh, mobile app will be like match.com or something where you'll be, you'll be able to talk to, uh, you know, other ladies on like, you know, dating sites. But, um, uh, but this right here that I, uh, only spent like maybe less than an hour, you know, putting this together. But, uh, this right here will be example right here of me right here, along with that, this, uh, this person right here. And, um, uh, let's just say that, um. If I were to have to work backwards to where that, uh, exactly, that, that this person right here looks a little bit, uh, maybe a little bit half Indian and maybe a part Hispanic American or somebody like that, but uh, it's supposed to be an example right here of uh, somebody that, that maybe I could meet one of these days, and yeah, that, that this person in particular that, uh, you know, you may have seen, you may have gotten an email about maybe a job offer or something, so let's just say that this lady were to say something like, uh, exactly, that you got, you were invited to go to a meeting, and let's just say uh, that the meeting said something like, uh, you know, meeting the company, and then a survey, and getting to know, uh, getting to know the members of the field, or something like that, and it's like, uh, so yeah, you know, for what we agree on, about basically, about uh, the things that, um, the changes that are being made, anything that's being discussed, and you know, that's that sort of stuff, and most of the time, with like, your know, insurance companies, that, um, uh, yeah, exactly. If you go to their website, it will be something like, uh, you know, chat live with a live agent and uh, especially insurance. And uh, let's just say that this lady in particular that I do meet one of these days, that uh, she might uh, call me. I'm like, yeah, you know, she could maybe be working as a realtor or maybe uh, she could also be uh, working for an insurance company. So really... How are you going to be able to meet somebody, really, if you don't go into that path to where that during a time that you did not have, uh, you know, yeah, exactly, that, uh, you know, uh, somebody found you just because that, um, you know, something uh, that, that you had, you know, something that, that they were just uh, concerned about uh, the matter. So let's just say that, uh, yeah, if it was uh, maybe from the doctor's office, if you get a, you know, if you get a message uh, from uh, the website telling you that, uh, you know, you have an appointment, you know, scheduled for 4 p.m. or something like that. So, so yeah, it could be uh, a nurse or a doctor, and let's just say this person in particular, that, uh, you know, that you were, you know, you may have been referred to, uh, you know, referred to them, you know, by, you know, by the doctor. And uh, so, really, that, uh, you know, whenever you meet people, uh, 
it seems like a lot of times that if the question's really about is to where if there's like any sort of romantic connection in between, you know, a, a th group of three people or something like that, you know, somebody was falling in love with you just because that's how they found you. That's how they found you just by, you know, what that, you know, the work that you were working on and maybe something else that you were working on too that uh, the day, uh, that's how that they, uh, they were unable to connect with you and, um, Really, if it's right or wrong, and uh, if anybody were, and I could probably say too that, uh, you know, really, that uh, could we really agree to where that, that that's the best way of how to meet people, that's the best way of how to meet, uh, that's the best way of how to date people, that how to date lady, like you find a special, anybody in particular, and yeah, I, I'm not talking about necessarily about that, uh, you know, drawing like a little portrait painting of a, of a woman and then go ahead and add in, in the makeup right there and then uh, anything else uh, that she could be wearing. And <laughs> you say that, yeah, this is how I found you, Matthew, is that, uh, yeah, that uh, I, I found your profile and I want to know, that are you interested in getting insurance or something? Uh, yeah, this person possibly could be just doing her job. She could say something like, uh, you know, we noticed that I noticed that, uh, you know, your insurance, we uh, we are now offering a higher deductible or something like, yeah, you know, we are offering a, a higher premium uh, you know, to help uh, to get insurance and you know, to be able to pay for your your premium cost. And uh, all you got to do is just enroll or fill out this application right here. So, yeah, that uh, really, how are you going to be able to meet the, the best ways of how to meet people? You know, it seems like it's all about that to where I'm, that uh, they're trying to do business with you. They're trying to maybe trying to do the, like the sales. I'm like, uh, yeah, that this person could maybe be working for the pharmacy or could be working for the department to where that they're reaching out to their clients about helping them uh, get you know insurance or it could maybe be uh, about uh, lower uh, credit card interest rates or something like that. Yeah. You could maybe get a phone call from uh, maybe from a company that would help you uh, lower your interest rates. You know, just by uh, you know exactly about working with them. You know, sign up uh, just to get some information about uh, what this company has to offer. So there's probably several ways of how you're able to meet people, but still, though, that it seems like uh, that uh, you know you may not always agree on ever on everything. I'm like uh, exactly that. Uh, if you're going to be, uh, exactly, that if you're going to be doing research about an insurance company or somebody that, uh, some, some company and trying to find out some information about something and, uh, possibly that, um, somebody that you're going to be connecting to and, uh, let's just say if you go to their website and then, uh, you find that, that chat, you know, if there's a website on the webpage that, uh, there's a way that you can connect to a live agent and, and uh, this person right here is going to maybe collect some information from you and they're going to say that uh, something like, uh, you know, if you believe that you are overpaying your know, credit card interest or maybe uh, mortgages or, you know, maybe something like that. So, so really that, uh, and uh, some of those phone calls too, uh, you know, anything text messages, you know, anything really, I'm like, yeah, text messages or something like that that you can think of. That uh, you might think this to where they are very annoying, and especially you know, the complete you know, just to be able to process you know, through a survey. That uh, that that seems like that that's how uh, somebody meets you is that uh, look at from where you were, you know, whenever they met you, and then from where you're planning on going, and so just to kind of be concerned of the matter. So even though that yeah, that you know, a number of activities I talk about you know, for like a little brother being a job, but. Uh, but let's just say the situation goes by as to where they're coming up to an agreement. Is coming up to an agreement considered a job? <laughs> so yeah, let's so let's just say that if you got an invitation from somebody, and uh, let's just say that uh, that it's the invitation said something like uh, meeting the company, and um, meeting the company, you know, please come to the meeting at this time at four. You know, at four p.m. or something like that. It may be a, a meeting at eight a.m. and you know, eight a.m. And uh, they ask you to complete on that the uh, oh, on the invitation. I ask you to uh, please re please bring a completed cover letter along with your resume to show that the manager, the hiring manager. And by the time you go to that interview, it, it seems like it's something different to where that that yo you're not really uh, meeting the company. You know this person's going to maybe tell you that uh, tell me that uh, 
you're not really meeting the company, Matthew. Uh, you know, the reason why you got that invitation was so that way, uh, you know, I can kind of, uh, you know, uh, to, you know, talk to you and like say, yeah. And so let's just say if that uh, meeting could maybe be in private to where that, uh, that, that, you know, just one person alone that wants to talk to me about something. And um, so it seems like that, uh, you know, exactly about, uh, you know, for agreements, though, that uh, any sorts of arguments and agreements that, uh, so it's like I say, is to where that, you know, whenever you uh, are going to be getting into an argument with somebody, it isn't always the fact about as to where who's going to win or it's about, you know, trying to get a settlement made, huh? <laughs> so let's just say that, uh, you know, yeah, like, well, that that's what you said last time, but then now this time I'm going to try this. And so, yeah, that uh, whenever you're going to have, you know, whenever you're going to, Get in an argument with somebody about something. It just seems like it is to where that um, you know you go by your own team. I'm like if you're trying to develop a team of, of the matter, trying to trying to get a team going to where you're trying to come up with uh, the points and uh, reasons and uh, you know conclusions and uh, your know, reasons for that. You know anything uh, such as the points of the matter. You know, like anything about you want to make a point of something. And it's something that you think that's going to work, something that you want to change. So that sort of stuff. And uh, so you're likely think is to where that, uh, you know, what does it usually mean whenever you cannot agree on everything? And so as I say that, yeah, I had this right here as to where, why is it so hard, you know, to go by the rules after you set the rules? So let's just say if the matter could have been as to where that, um, you know, something that you were working on and somebody else agreed about what was discussed. And uh, there's different ways of how we can describe uh, maybe a statement or maybe uh, anything about the the writing, uh, like something about what you call, you know, or something that's mentioned on a resume or maybe a cover letter or something like that. And uh, so let's just say it goes by as to where that you make a few points about something and then somebody's going to agree on that, and then that they're going to say is to her. But let's just say if the rule goes by is to her, the main objective or something like that. So let's just say if there's somebody else that's going to be reading a reading a a, a document that, that you were working on that I was working on, and uh, I was typing that up, and then uh, somebody else you know found it, and let's just say if that's on LinkedIn, uh, you know, a site like on LinkedIn. Uh, then uh, you're also wondering too that somebody else uh, that read that statement that you posted, uh, and so now it's like, uh, you know, did they agree or disagree about what was posted and what was discussed? And uh, and as uh, some of those who don't even understand it either, but um, but the way I think about it too is that uh, you know it's very frustrating sometimes whenever you have to work backwards. What I mean by work backwards is to where that looking back at, you know, nearly three uh, weeks ago, whenever you were working on something, and uh, by time that, that somebody uh, kind of, yeah, you know, kind of like, a, if you want to call it like, you know, besides an introduction, it's like a conclusion to where that, that you're trying to follow up with uh, what's been going on these past couple of days, and, uh, you know, somebody found uh, what you posted, uh, yeah, exactly, you know, whenever you put in a referral in, or whenever you put in a request in, I guess it's basically meaning is to where that, that, you know, you are asking for more information and you just got to wait for somebody to call you back about that, you know, that source of information and, uh, calling you back basically means is that, yeah, that just, a uh, review of the information and yeah, that, that, that source of stuff. And so I guess, not everybody, I guess, is going to be trained about how that works, especially on their mobile devices. So it seems like exactly that somebody wants to kind of say is to her, to make the long story short, this is how I met this person that apparently I had titled uh, that uh, request, such as is to where the argument versus agreement or something like that. So, yeah, meeting the company. And uh, so if anybody were to say that, yeah, that... Uh, it could maybe you know spay or scam or something like that, but still that um, if you're gonna be maybe be getting uh, an email and that that email is gonna maybe be titled something like meeting the company or please complete a survey or something, like, please uh, fill out a survey. Uh, you'll be like to get to know you best. So and, and I'm sure most of us who know a lot about you know about the internet, especially on our mobile phones, that uh, if you see. Uh, stuff that says something like meeting the company and uh and it seems like uh most of all of us will maybe say that uh 
you know, almost all the time. If you're going to be if you're going to be writing a letter or something, or maybe putting in a, a request, you know, for information about something, maybe if it is insurance. You know, it seems like that you only have about maybe five minutes in between just to do all that. So if anybody say that, what all really, you know, if anybody were to ask me that, what all really can you get done within five minutes? <laughs> really, what can you do within five minutes that's really going to make a difference to the whole situation? I'm like, well, if anything, check for updates and uh, maybe to, uh, you know, update uh, the profile page or maybe to... Um, to update any you know, anything that needs to be changed on a profile, or I'm like, yeah, the things that maybe that uh, that you can improve within five minutes. But sometimes it seems like that to where that that whenever you see uh, an advertisement such as you meeting the company, then uh, maybe not everybody's going to be very clear about what you're talking about, what you're stating until you know, give it three more, give it three weeks or so, give it three weeks, and maybe somebody's going to find that and somebody's going to say that uh exactly about that you know until they uh yeah exactly you know why why and sometimes why does it take maybe five or six weeks you know just to realize something but uh nowadays with the internet you one or two uh that uh you know not nowadays with this uh with the 60 or 100 uh, megabytes per second you know high speed internet that why is it that people cannot realize what's really going on within maybe a few seconds, you know, compared to, uh, you know, exactly that uh, whenever you, uh, whenever somebody contacts you about something or, you know, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know, we can all really explain the stories about how we meet people necessarily. How we meet people and uh, one of those meeting that people could be used to were that uh, somebody that met you uh, Maybe, uh, yeah, exactly. That I don't know if the if Craigslist has uh, anything to where it could set a profile, but if you were maybe working for a business and uh, somebody, uh, you know, exactly that uh, somebody found you just because that that you were working at, yeah, you know, yeah, that maybe that uh, you were selling catalogs maybe on Craigslist or some site like that, or it could also be, uh, you know, working for a certain company where you're getting certain quotes about something, you know. You know, like a working for an insurance company, uh, or maybe writing a statement or something like that, or maybe getting feedback from other clients about what you think about this or that, <laughs> shopping experience, you know, that sort of stuff. And uh, so it's like say that is to where that uh, you know meeting the company though that um, that so it seems like that um, that whenever people cannot agree, uh, whenever we cannot agree on everything, really, is there anything wrong with that to where you cannot come up to an agreement with something? And uh, so it seems like, yeah, that uh, somebody else is going to be mad because you did not agree uh, on uh, something that was talked about during the meeting or something like that. And uh, and uh, whenever that does happen, uh, it's like, exactly, is there anything wrong with that? Or does that basically mean that you're not my friend anymore or something like that? But, uh, I guess that we could probably say is that, um, you know, really, that, you know, do we really have to agree on everything? And, um, and that's just, uh, I guess the point of the matter to where that, you know, for many times, the meetings that I've had, and plus, uh, you know, anything with about certain cases that were going on, uh, and trying to fix certain things, and, uh, so you're likely think is to where that, uh, you know, yeah, exactly, uh, you know, has anybody had, a uh, had done it to where they say that yeah well you know talk to the hand you know talk to the hand and you so yeah I if anybody has uh, gotten rude and said something like that to somebody but still that uh, when whenever you're gonna be working on something and let's just say that you're gonna be talking about something and uh, somebody else makes a suggestion to you and that that uh, you may not agree with that suggestion and uh, so it's like yeah that um, so let's just say that uh, if you were you. So you know, start researching the internet and maybe found out. I'm like, yeah, that, that you heard about that to where a lot of times, whenever you're getting ready to maybe take care of a bill or something like that, or maybe that uh, if you're just checking out, uh, you're checking something out. You maybe on your mobile phone, you know, even by email, and uh, they said you'll know, you hear about that to where that you know if you uh, if you're getting tired of being put on hold, uh, you know, from a phone call or whichever, then, then yeah, you you can always try to chat with a live agent to be able to assist you. So, so yeah, a lot of that stuff that uh, you know, even if it's taking care of your taxes, 
that uh, they had this live chat, you know, like, you know, chat live with a live agent, you know, to be able to assist you. So it's basically that, uh, you know, yeah, that uh, if anybody asks is that, what's the difference between that and then actually using the actual email service? But I guess that, you know, emails, usually you don't get responses uh, from an email within about maybe a few hours. So let's just say if it is about maybe about every eight hours or so that you're going to be getting a response from an email. But, uh, you know, you're using it, the chat live, you know, uh, your icon, you know, from the websites, you know, going to, you know, downloading the mobile app just to be able to talk to a live agent that you're able to get responses right away from the, I guess, from the agents there. And um, you're able to connect to somebody and. If there's a question about something, and uh, and yeah, the, you know, if anybody were asked as to where that uh, are you, uh, you're connected to an automated system, you know, this automated system that might have a, you know, and be able to assist you with what uh, you got a question about or something like that. But uh, really, how many of us are really going to agree that talk to an automated system? But uh, there are a lot of your know, programs out there to do the work uh, that do what you call the programmers that uh, yeah, especially. Uh, Offered to those uh, software programs like uh, you know for uh, you know Windows 10 you know for if most of us are familiar with like the PC uh, you know for you know for the um, most of us are familiar with uh, the you know our computers though that uh, you have like uh, certain editions of you know for Windows 10 to where that that you have this uh, computer to where it talks to you and ask you okay. Uh, you know, ask me anything. Well, well, you know, what would you like that? What would you? What do you need help with today, or something like? So yeah, that. Uh, so this person, I'm like, yeah, it could be an automated system too. With this automated system, I guess it's basically, uh, you know, a way of it's it's able to generate its information just by uh, from uh, you know how you you buy from the computer. I guess uh, you know how is it getting its power compared to an actual person? You know, the person's knowledge, huh? Whenever you're actually able to talk to an actual person, that exactly that you're not really talking to uh, an, a robot, if you want to call it like a robot. But uh, anyway, uh, but uh, talk about say for meeting people, and uh, so that's one thing I would want to talk about. I want to you know just talk about also about as to where if you're going to be uh, arguing about something that seems like as to where that uh, exactly that uh, you know exactly that you you. Uh, Whenever you argue about something that you are basically, uh, if you want to call it sticking up for your right, and you know you really that uh, you know, don't want, you know, don't agree on uh, what was uh, you know about the ideas, like if you want to call it the ideas and suggestions. So, so let's just say if this was uh, maybe in a meeting room or something like that, and uh, somebody talks about doing something or talks about planning something ahead of time, and you may not agree with that something, and. Uh, so it's like say this to where that uh, you know exactly whenever you argue it seems like that you're fighting you know a lot of times <laughs> exactly that you know you may not like the idea of fighting about stuff but uh, I guess if anybody were to say that uh, you know are you really fighting whenever you're arguing about something you cannot come up with an agreement on something and uh, so it seems like um, that yeah that whenever you're uh, Whenever you're arguing about something, it seems like, uh, I don't know if it's really about the matter of winning or losing about the situation, but about the fact about, you know, exactly, that, uh, you know, something's going to be settled sooner, sooner or later, but uh, but still, though, that uh, some of us may say that you're know, arguing, you know, yeah, exactly, that you know, you argue with the person the last time, and so you cannot argue, am I? But still, that uh, so I mean, anyway, say that yeah, that uh, whenever you argue, I guess, are you learning anything whenever you argue, and whenever you come up to an agreement on something, are you really learning anything whenever you come up to an agreement on something? But it seems like it's all about getting something done, you know. I guess uh, what are you gonna say other than that? Uh, you know, you know the whole process. Of, you know, you're trying to get somewhere. You're trying to get something done, and I want to be able to get that something done that you got to come up with. If you want to kind of call it like I said, I'm introduce and then conclusion about what the problem is, and it may be the you know how to fix that problem, and then it could also be uh, related to um, the fact about you know exactly that uh, I signed up and. I did not set the rules, so in case if anybody were asked me, uh, you know, almost it's almost always the question to where 
that, uh, you know, when you meet somebody and they're going to ask you questions and uh, it seems like sometimes that you feel like telling them that, you know, I thought that was already answered. You know, I answered that earlier. You're earlier in the meeting. And uh, so let's just say at this meeting was uh, maybe like posted up on LinkedIn to where you're going to have people talking about something and and uh, you posted your answer on uh, you know, in the comment section on LinkedIn, and uh, you're likely thinking as to where that, uh, you know, oh, okay, uh, you know, exactly, that, uh, you know, you were not, you know, you may have been, you know, you may have gotten emails, uh, notifications about uh, what your responses are, and but maybe somebody's going to maybe say that, hey, I had too much going on, I was not able to read the email. What did you say, uh, you, know, you know, from that meeting that we talked about from last week? So somebody's going to maybe, uh, exactly, that uh, you answered the question, but then, uh, you know, maybe once or twice that, um, that somebody's going to maybe connect with you maybe on Facebook and ask you again. <laughs> so it seems like it's more of your time or what. But but why is it so hard to go by the rules after you set the rules? So let's just say if, the, if this person were to ask me that to where, that, uh, you know, yeah, if you could set the rules, so what rule would do you think that that would be? Uh, is to where that uh, the discussion would be advised to where personal ID. And so let's just say that, you know, if you could set the rule to where that uh, only that allow your personal ID to go be flexible with your other clients. And so it's like, say, yeah, that uh, two weeks later, and then uh, she's going to maybe start asking you about that. And say, you know, that, yeah, be flexible with your other clients. What does that mean? Like an... Well, listen, yeah, you know, I, so yeah, exactly, that be flexible with your other clients. I, I don't understand, what does that mean? You know, I say that, yeah, well, you know, listen, you know, that was more likely a, a statement, actually, but you know, still, that, uh, so somebody's going to maybe uh, ask me later on, uh, after they read the discussions or something like that, and then they're going to ask the question to where, what does that mean? Well, what do you mean by that? Or what does it have to do with the discussion? So it seems like exactly that uh, anything about what you call personality, that uh, how you meet people, that um, they're going to ask questions. I guess the goal of the matter will really be is to where that they got your letter, they uh, read your posting, but then now they're trying to understand it. So it seems like it goes by the next steps as to where that they're going to constantly keep bothering you. They're going to, somebody's going to constantly keep sending you emails about something. Somebody's going to constantly uh, be uh, texting you and asking you about, what did you mean by that? Or that's interesting. So yeah, exactly. You know, meeting the company, you know, meeting the company that um, it seems like to where it's not just, you know, the company, it's also about the Getting to know the clients and then the, the the team, I guess if you were caught, you know, getting to know the team very well. But I guess uh, the best ways of how we can talk about your know, for agreements, though, is that yeah, exactly that, uh, and especially the surveys and uh, how many of us have come across that point to where that uh, you know, whenever you get a phone call and maybe that that uh, they're telling you that there are rates that that could apply. You know, if you're going to be talking to somebody. Uh, maybe from your mobile phone and uh and say rates could apply if you agree to accept charges or something like that. So I know a lot of the things that that we're even doing, you know, even even if it's related to our taxes, yeah, you may not always agree to pay uh, a certain percentage rate, you know, just for you know, exactly. And uh so I and I can tell anybody here that you know if you want to know uh, the best way how to describe it, just it's it's a deposit. Yeah, it's a deposit, you know when in order to be able to get something done, it seems like you had to make a deposit first. And um, that deposit we're talking about can be, you know, can be between a five or maybe 10%. <laughs> so in order to be able to get to know the company very well, that they're going to want you to complete a survey and complete an application. And uh, there might be a fee for that to up to maybe 20%. But uh, really, who all, you know, do, do we all really want to argue about that? Argue about you know, it, this is not going to cost me anything, or if it is, and I'm not going to, I'm not going to proceed with the uh, the whole, uh, you know, uh, you know, with the whole meeting. I'm not going to proceed with the, sur the surveyor, but, but still, though, that uh, I'm sure you, know, most of us have been there to where that we don't have any money, but, uh, but still, that that let's just say that the situation goes by as to where that they're gonna, you know, somebody, this company is trying to get a better understanding about what you do. 
So whenever somebody meets me, and uh, let's just say that uh, exactly that, that whenever you sign up, or maybe that uh, it could have been a, maybe a mistake of the matter, and you know, I could say that yo, you were on our website, and uh, yo, you mentioned on the application that you want to get to know uh, the clients on the team a little bit more, and uh, you you had set the rules or something like that. So yeah, exactly. It seems like it goes by, say, the long story of the discussion, huh, about meeting the company. <laughs> But you know, anyway, but uh, really, we may not, you know, somebody uh, always got had the question, but uh, talk about for settlements, though. But um, but in order to be able to come up with an agreement, though, it, it seems like as to where that exactly that, uh, you know, you may not be able to agree on everything, but at least uh, it seems like as to where that to agree is to where, yep, well, thank you for your time. And at least that, that's the best thing that you could say is to where, well, thanks for your time. Well, so sorry, you know, I'm not going to do that. Well, I am too. You know, I am sorry too, but you know, thanks for your time. But um, other than that, I guess you say that, yeah, it's important to have insurance and it's important to uh, get the matters fixed. But um, other than that, it's like, yeah, do the best you can. But other than that, yeah, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.